representing Janvi Kapoor of the influenza community. I think this looks nice, right? I think I've nailed the look. Oh my god, I'm so proud of myself. Okay, what's up? What's up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my setup. I've been shooting a lot of vlogs and I've been trying out different content. But did you all miss me? Like this feels different, right? Me in vlogs and me sitting down like this, it feels like two completely different people, right? Like this feels more like and that feels like chalo chalo shopping and chalo 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 ye karte. Let me know if you all want me to like make more vlogs because yeah, I mean, why not, dude? It's so much fun. But it feels so good to be home and like, you know, sitting down and talking to y'all. This feels like, ah, chalo, ab bed ke. Gap shap karte hai, thoda makeup karte hai, thoda idhar udhar ki baate karte hai. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Sunday video. We are just sitting down doing my makeup. Today, I wanted to recreate a look. My stylist, Mithal. Shout out to Mithal. She's such a cutie. She's such a sweetheart. She sent me a sari which uh, inspired me to recreate this look by Deepika Padukone. The sari exactly matches her sari. And I was like, bro, we got this. Okay. Without wasting any more time, let's get started because I'm going to be talking a lot anyway in the video. So, let's begin. So, I'm going to start with uh, the moisturizer that I'm using currently. The new Moisture Surge uh, 100 Hours. I use a lot of moisturizer these days before my makeup because it kind of like makes my makeup look more natural. Foundation sort of like becomes more dewy. Like, I used to do that earlier as well, but this is different, like, somehow, because I don't let the moisturizer, like, really go into my skin. I apply the foundation really fast. So, moving on to the primer, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Putty Primer. Okay, how have you all been? I am legit just trying to juggle and balance things between, like, my studio and, uh, you know, like... Instagram and all other things and it feels amazing to be back after that short little break that I took um, It just feels good because I have all these creative ideas I have all this energy that I really want to constantly keep working, which is not a good thing by the way I'm not glorifying uh, The fact that you need to like really work Every single day. It's just that I have all that energy and I really want to put it to use, you know It's become like sort of a routine. You actually should take a break if you feel like uh, you know, you're stuck in a creative block or something like that if you are a creator or if you're in a creative field or something like that. even if you're not in a creative field if you feel like you know you're just feeling stuck take a break like breathe it's all right take a day off watch Netflix do whatever that feels right to you uh, that you think you know will just give you that peace of mind that you're craving okay, I'm using a k-beauty foundation and just do it man just go for it trust me I mean you will not be disappointed you will in fact come back strong also today i wanted to do like another dating video but i didn't really have like a proper topic in my head i had to take down the last dating tip video because sometimes you know it's very difficult to put your own ideas across because you have to be politically correct um, all the time on the internet and people really just take your words and your statements out of context and they drag it and they make it into things that you didn't even think about in the first place so I didn't really want to create drama I figured that a lot of people actually got triggered so I was like you know what it's best to just take down that video so I'll probably make another video soon around the same thing so that you know um, I can convey the same thoughts probably in a better manner Bro, I didn't recreate the photo I didn't check it like, I was just makeup because I saw this one picture long back and I'm like, what do I want to recreate? I was going to make up but I was going to recreate exactly Okay, did I just say Deepika Padukone? Because I'm going to take my words back It's actually Janvi Kapoor So I'm recreating this look This one, I'm going to put it here um, It's in this green, pretty green sari I don't have a green blouse though. So now the thing is that when you're creating a look which is very like a uh, bearable and simple like an everyday glam, you don't really do a full face using like concealer, this, that, all of that. I mean they do use because I know I've like seen it up close. I don't wish to like bring that up every time I'm doing like a recreation of a celebrity that you know I've worked in Bollywood. Uh, but yeah, I have. But very simple. They keep it very, very minimal um, to the point that they use the product on their fingers, they warm it on their hands and then they you know like tap it on the face so that it looks very natural so even if the camera like really zooms into your skin it still looks like skin you know I mean I'm using the NYX uh, full coverage concealer but I'm gonna use it very little okay I'm just gonna like use this to like brighten my under eyes and all that Another thing, I'm home alone since a week now. My parents have actually gone to live at the studio to make it more functional because there's a lot of work 
and I don't know when that's gonna happen. Man, January this year, like I remember, I've been screaming, chilla chilla ke dunya ko bol rahi hu. Mera studio banra, mera studio banra. Pata nahi jaise koi Taj Mahal banra. Aur abhi tak kuch nahi hua. Like I'm like literally, jitna like you know the video that I've made for you all. That is it. This is how much it has been since the video now. Because IKEA is shut. Meri kismat hi kharaab. I'm telling you, bro, we to. It's been a week. Me and my brother, we've been living alone, and. Bro, like I'll tell you the realities of when you grow up. It's so different because अगर मेरी mom पहले कहीं बाहर चली जाती ना like for a week, trust me, this would have turned into like a bachelor pad. And यहाँ पे सिर्फ 24 घंटे party हो रही होती, यहाँ पे कोई एक ना एक या दो friend तो कोई घर पे होता constantly. और यहाँ पे भाई मजे हो रहे होते हैं, you know what I mean? But not anymore, bro. Not anymore. Trust me. We wake up on time. We do the exact same thing that we do. Otherwise, also we go to the gym and we come back. We are doing our work the entire day. We are eating food on time and all that. Sleeping on time. Reading books and all that. And I'm like, bro, we change कब हुआ? I'm not even sure if this is like थोड़ा तो खराब होना चाहिए इंसान को कहीं ना कहीं. I feel like fun का है इसमें. But मैं इतनी अच्छी कब हो गई, bro? पता ही नहीं चला। Also your girl started MMA classes. I have no idea why. What got into me, and now I really want to get into kickboxing. Like not become like a fighter or anything, but I enjoy the whole kickboxing class because it's a good way to release energy. Mostly because you know we've been sitting at home and there's like not a lot of physical activity that you get to do. So kickboxing is actually a good way to release all of that energy. And once you start going to the gym, you really want to like get into more activities. It's just very normal. I'm gonna be using uh, the Benefit Love Tint. I'm gonna put that on my hand before I put it on my face. Also, yes, update on my filler situation. I did not go for the second uh, session, and I don't think now because it's been it's been almost one and a half month, right? So I don't think now she'll even take me or she'll even entertain my request for a second session because the filler actually doesn't last for more than 15 days once you open it. So yeah, that is gone. The opportunity is gone for me, or I don't know. I mean, I don't know. It's just that. I'm really scared. I'm like, what if खराब हो गया तो और ज़्यादा हो जाएगा? इतना ही ठीक है मैं इतने में खुश हूँ. You know, इतना makeup के बाद इतना ठीक ही लगता है ज़्यादा भी नहीं है कम भी नहीं है. You know, like I still want to look like myself. She's got really bushy brows in the picture, and she's got very soft pinky, you know, eyelids. That's what we're gonna do today. So I'm gonna use a brow filler, and I'm gonna like really make my brows very bushy. It's actually pretty simple, you know, but I want to do like a twist to this because I don't just want to stick to like the basic uh, recreation. I'm going to do something different out of this. I'm going to be using the K-Beauty Matte Blush in Sugar Candy as my eyeshadow because this is exactly the color that she has on her eyes. I'm going to use like a nude shade from an eyeshadow palette, whatever nude shade. You can also use a bronzer to do this. And I'm going to really just intensify the outer corner and just a little bit of shimmer to catch that dewiness that she has on her eyes and I'm just gonna like apply that all over my eyelids so it doesn't look like I have a lot of shimmer but just the right amount okay, then I'm gonna take a brown uh, kajal pot this is by Etude House it's in the shade Milky Milk Brown basically she's gonna go very close to my lash line So this is gonna sort of intensify my lid without making it like too obvious or in your face. And then we are going to use a mascara. Use a setting spray before I proceed. I'm just gonna let all the powders like sink into my face. So for my lips, basically I'm just trying to see what works and what gets me closer to her lip color. I'm gonna use a nude lip uh, liner. This is by Provati. I'm not even sure if the brand is still like there anymore. I haven't, I haven't been to a store in the longest time. So this was really just available at like you know beauty stores. Okay, on top of this, I'm gonna dab a little bit of the L'Oreal Paris Rouge Signature in the shade I Rule. I think it comes really close to the color she's wearing. So I'm gonna take a little bit on my hand. 
and I'm going to use my finger to dab this. Yeah, nice. I'm going to use a little gloss because gloss is literally my thing these days. Literally what she's done. I'm going to do the twist later, but for now, let me just change into the outfit and be back in like a second. Can you all see? I'll give you like a better picture. So she has like hair done in like a very low messy uh, pony or something if you want to do a hairstyle if you're trying to copy like a low bun or a messy hairstyle or something and you're like dude how did she get it like that you know how does it look like she's not put in an effort and like you know it still looks so good it's because when you're doing a look like that just make sure that you curl your hair um inwards outwards like one side inward and then the other one outward and just like be easy with it like you don't really have to worry about where the curl is going and whatever because anyway it's going to be up in a bun or something right Just run your hands through your hair once you're like done curling your hair up. You've basically just taken everything at the back like that. Okay, and just tie it up in like a very loose pony. Or like a, you know, choti. So it'll look like a very messy braid. But that's what you want. Really worry about all of this. We're gonna pin it up. But for now, this is how it should look like. Just a very messy I think we've pretty much achieved the look. Time for jewelry. Having like the recreations that I've been doing, it is so much fun. Like, oh my god. Guys, I'm gonna be honest. I think I nailed the look. Or what? Did I nail the look or what? Presenting Janvi Kapoor of the influenza community. I think this looks nice, right? I think I've nailed the look. Oh my god, I'm so proud of myself. Oh, it's wearable. This is, you know, I've been loving, I've been enjoying doing makeup looks that I will personally wear. Like, this is like this mehndi look that you can wear where your friends are mehndi or you're just getting ready and you're like, oh bro, I'm late. So I just did this look so quickly, so quickly. You get it? In reality, it took you two hours. But... We're not gonna tell that. You know what? Like, I wanna do a twist to this. So, I'm gonna try a reverse wing liner on this look, create my own twist to this. What I'm gonna do is just take a casual, okay? And you're gonna start from the bottom. And it's a very simple uh, reverse wing, you know? It's actually easier than the actual wing liner. So, what I'm doing is I'm just lining the lower lash line. Use whatever casual that you have. And also fill in your waterline, okay? Now once you have that, I'm gonna pull the outer end a little outside, like just create an upward wing like that, okay? And just a little bit connect it with the lash line. A blending brush and I'm just gonna like smoke that out a little bit so that there are no harsh edges. You can also use a little bit of brown eyeshadow while you're blending this part out. So I've been personally loving this, okay? Like it's a little too extra, but I really like it because it's grungy, it's got edge, it's got this sass to it. Even the upper part, just blend it out. Just use a little bit of highlighter to like highlight your brow bone and your inner corners. And voila, this is it. This is look number two um, with my twist to Janvi Kapoor's look. Let me know what you guys think. I like it. I'm obsessed with reverse wing liner at the moment, so I love it. I think I'll totally wear this. I'm not really a liner person. I'm usually like a smoky liner kind of a person, but this really is my style. It really just brings the focus to my face and it's so much easier than doing like a smoky eye look because all you have to do is just follow the shape of your eye and like smoke it out. Too good. Alright, 
you guys so this is it this is the finished look i hope you all enjoyed watching this that's the zomato bag <laughs> that's my lunch so that is it you guys this is the finished look this is my twist to janvi kapoor's makeup look that i recreated earlier if you guys enjoyed the video let me know what you think about this should i make more videos with like twists and like you know stuff like that ever suggestions you guys have please let me know in the comment section below i love reading your comments as always hope you all enjoyed this video if you did not forget to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel before you leave also if you try out this look don't forget to tag me i would love to see your recreations and with that that's it for now sleep tight lots of hugs and kisses to everybody and i will see you all this tuesday bye